fucked up. It's Severin, uh, representing the uh, Now and Ever crew and the Dirty Rotten Scandals crew, Vancouver, Canada. Like, we're known for a lot of things, but we're not really known for having, like, an identity like a lot of other cities have. Like, we're known for, like, rain as our identity. Other than that, it's just, like, a nice city. On the plus side of that, that allows for all the, a lot of the dancers in the scene to be, like, wildly creative. There's tons of very creative uh, dancers just in general in the scene. So, I mean, I try to emulate that spirit. Like, I always try to strive to make try to make like as creative as I possibly can so I actually got really heavily inspired by Bounce B-Boy Bounce from Boogie Brats recently and uh, he taught a workshop here and I kind of flipped his ideas so I like to try to think of between like every small movement which even if it's just the first two steps of a six step um, there's tons of things that you can do just in between those so I call those like little infinities in between the numbers one and two there's literally infinite numbers and then an infinite sequence of numbers yeah i just try to explore look at breaking from a variety of different perspectives you know just try to keep growing try to keep doing what i can do now and yeah be like an artist and shit <laughs> What we're doing now, uh, because it was mad windy outside, I'm gonna narrate over the footage that we already shot so you guys can hear. The first move that we have, I call it the Chun-Li kicks because I think she deserves a move, for real. So it starts off, you're gonna kick with your right foot um, and then you're gonna kick again to uh, get yourself a bit higher and then you're gonna kick back. Um, you're gonna kick uh, up with your left and then you're gonna kick your left back and put your left hand on the ground and then you're gonna kick over and then the last move is you just kick with your left and then you can do it you can restart it again by kicking with your right leg and then up and then you just keep going so those are the Chun-Li kicks Second move, I call it the lazy three-step because that's how I ended up making it was being too lazy to do a three-step. But it might have another name, so I'm sorry if I I missed that. But anyways, you're gonna start um, just like a normal six-step. Um, you do the first three steps, but instead of uh, kicking with your left out, you're just gonna bring it in, and then you're gonna turn around and then restart the six-step. Um, so it doesn't look like much, but if you do it quick, it can be pretty dynamic. Alright, last move, it's called the pinball machine and I just wanted to incorporate more stuff on my knees especially the weird like lever sort of move um, so once again it's it's uh, within a six step but when you f first start the move um, you're gonna instead of just stepping back you're gonna land on your right knee with your left leg out and then you're gonna kick your uh, right leg in and then switch so that you're on your left knee and then kick that in and then you just finish your sixth step. So that's the pinball machine. Hope you enjoyed the, the moves that I brought. Just uh, take them, try to flip them, make them your own, and I hope I hope it helped. Peace. <laughs>